Hey there, we're here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep headquarters. And today we are excited to show the 2018 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited JL. This is the Sahara package. This is our first Sahara that we got in of the JL. And I thought I'd do a little video so that we can show some of the options off on this pretty sweet Jeep and uh, learn a little bit more about the JL and the Sahara package on the new JL. First thing you'll notice is the new rims. These are 18 inch polished aluminum and painted alloy rims. And they have Bridgestone Dueler HT tires. These are 25570R18s. Got the highway tread on them. And I know there's been a little debate on my YouTube channel. Um, they are calling the new JLs Unlimiteds, and there's the proof right there. It says Jeep Wrangler Unlimited on there. They got the Sahara badge right there, lettering. Got this little recess in the uh, front fender there. This one does come with the painted fenders which uh, kind of sticks with the tradition of the Sahara having the painted fenders. Has the new running boards, which look really cool. The LED running lights in the fenders. This one has the LED lighting group, so you get the LED fog lights, the LED headlamps, and the LED ring running lamps there. They look really good. You also get the LED tail lights with that group. The seven slotted grill has the silver inlays. I like what they did with the front bumper. Very good looking. I like what they did with the fenders. They are a little bit more rounded. So they, you'll notice that the front grille is arched back just a little bit. as to help with the aerodynamics. Same thing with the, the windshield. It's leaned back just a little bit farther to increase the aerodynamics of the vehicle. Overall, there is a 9% reduction in drag with the new body style. I like they did the body lines on the doors. I think it makes it look really tough. As the, uh, they added these hinges on the doors, and you can see it says T50. Well, that's a Torx 50 for the bolt underneath here, so you know which Torx wrench to use. Pretty cool. The new step bars, all one pad, as opposed to the old Sahara's which had like two pads. Still four wheel disc brakes. This one has the color matched hard top. These doors are aluminum now. They made this Wrangler uh, 200 pounds lighter than the previous JK. This one has the backup sensors. They all come with the backup camera now. You can see the LED lights in the back here. You can also get LEDs for the license plate light. Backup sensors are new to the JL body style. Now this is an example of one without the Alpine sound system in it so you can see it frees up probably about a good 8 to 10 inches uh, back here as far as space width wise you still get the storage compartment underneath and then your holders for the door hinges and roof bolts and now they got a spot for the windshield bolts since they made it so easy to take the windshield out or put it down I should say and these are roll bars. They got those painted. They look really nice. The one thing that they added this year, or to the JL package, is when you take your hard top off, they got a spot to put the wiring. So in the past, it was always kind of an issue. Where do you, where do you put those wires so that they're not just dangling around? So you can take that off, put it in there, and the same thing with the windshield washer. They got a little spot to clip that in as well. But uh, very easy to use. 
And I did want to show you that this one does have the insulated hardtop. So that's an option from Jeep. So you got the padding up here and on the sides and then on the front panels it's there as well. So those seats do go down. When they are down you have about five feet, eight inches from the back here to all the way up to the front seats of flat storage space. You know a lot of people have been asking about that. So it's about five foot eight inches. We measured it the other day. The rear gate is a magnesium and aluminum composite or you know they kind of put it both on there to make it lighter and they also added this badge back here it tells you how much water fording you can do and then the overall length and wheelbase of the two-door and the four-door right there so it also tells you where it was built in and developed in Toledo Ohio this one was built in and was uh, developed in Auburn Hills Michigan I like how the gate shuts. It's really light compared to the old JKs. Down this side, just a really good redesign on the Wrangler. Everybody's been really excited about these and Jeep definitely didn't let us down. Uh, this one has the enter and go system. So you basically just have to have the key fob on you and when you put your hands in the doors, they'll automatically unlock. This one has the blind spot monitoring, which is new for this year. And these mirrors are heated. They are a manual fold-in, like so. And they are power mirrors as well. So this is the first look at the Sahara interior. They still have the stitching in the backrest right there. Nice stitching on the leather. This is the tan interior. Factory floor mats has the auto headlamps and the fog light buttons right there as well. Inside you can see it's the 7 inch TFT display. They have redesigned the steering wheel and I like that they didn't make it like any of the other steering wheels. It's similar to the other steering wheels but it's completely different than any of the steering wheels that you see on the Jeep lineup. You got your cruise controls, your information center controls right here. They still have the radio controls on the back of the steering wheel and the cruise controls are right there. This one has the seven inch uh, screen right here. You can see you got your heated seats and heated steering wheel buttons on there. You can also check out the backup cam and the biggest gripe, one of the biggest gripes was that Wranglers never had a backup camera or you could get a Mopar one but it was never that great of a camera well now they have them standard and they're like ultra HD super clear backup camera the lines turn when you turn the steering wheel so it's uh, really a, a nice system and uh, you have AM FM Sirius XM radio capabilities you also have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto capabilities looking at the dash here in the uh, Rubicons and the sports this piece right here is metal in the Saharas, it's a stitched leather. Really nice insert on there and uh, looks really good. Looks really, you know, gives it a little bit of class to the uh, vehicle. This one has the part-time four-wheel drive system, which is new to the Wranglers this year. Uh, this is the first one that we've seen. It's also the first one, it's the only one we have on the lot right now. So you can do the four-wheel drive high and then you can also do the part-time four-wheel drive high which is uh, you know it's never been done on the Wranglers before and then of course we have the eight-speed transmission automatic and then it's got the little red handle on it and of course the Jeep on the top there some of the controls right here you have your heated and cool or your heated seats heated steering wheel you got your dual climate control which is new for this year your auto start stop feature so you can turn that off if you don't want it on uh, just a button right there, stability control, downhill assist control. You can turn the screen off and just touch it to turn it back on. And uh, you got your climate controls there as well. You can also do your climate controls up here. And I like they added this mode button. You used to only be able to do it up here from where you wanted it to blow, but now you can have it down here. You can choose where you want it to blow too. So anyways, here's the original window sticker for this vehicle and yes you can see it says Wrangler Unlimited Sahara so they are definitely calling the JL's Unlimited's 
uh, and you can see all the options there. This one has the LED lighting group, the cold weather group, the safety uh, active safety group, which gives you the park sense and blind spot monitoring and cross path detection. It has the hard top headliner, which is a $525 option, dollar option. The select track full time four wheel drive system is a $595 option, anti spin rear differential, and the remote proximity keyless entry system. Uh, that hard top color matched is a $2,095 option as well. So, really nice Wrangler, lots of stuff in it. Um, you know, that eight speed really, as you can see on here, you got an estimated 23 miles a gallon on the highway and that's, that's all because of the eight speed. So the little tool kit that they give you now has only two of these in here, still get the wrench, but this is for the windshield wipers. Uh, you can take, it's the bolt to take the windshield wipers off since they've made it easier to take the windshield down. So all that is good stuff. Factory floor mats, the doors are nicely trimmed. You can see the insulated hardtop in the front here. They don't have the little screws anymore that used to go right here. Uh, they've eliminated those, but for the most part, it looks like the hard top comes off approximately the same way as it used to. Take a quick look at the back seats. Now they've made the side curtain airbags standard in the front and I've been asked if they have side curtain airbags in the back. They do not have side curtain airbags in the back. And I think it's because, you know, they really don't have a spot to put them with the hard top here. Uh, but you still have your three bolts on the side to take that back hard top piece off. It does have the latch child safety system. The one thing I will notice that you'll notice once you sit in the back of here, there's a lot more leg room than uh, the old JK. And I don't know if they did that by making the entire vehicle longer or exactly how they achieved that, but it's a lot more room back here. And I'm sure that car seats will fit back here a little bit better as well. You do have a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in, two U normal USB jacks, and then two USB-C jacks back here as well. And that's where your power window buttons are. And uh, these seats do go down and they go almost completely flat. And like I was saying before, up to about here is five foot, eight inches to the back gate. So all the way up here to the back is about five foot, eight inches, um, the measurement that I got. So speakers back here as well, and then that insulated hard top. We'll just, uh, we'll just take a quick peek under the hood here. Make sure to subscribe to our channel. We're gonna be doing uh, more videos as soon as it gets a little bit warmer, some tutorials on how to take the hard top off. And uh, when we get a soft top in, we'll do some tutorials on how those work as well. But uh, subscribe and see all the new Jeep stuff coming out. This is still a 3.6 liter uh, Pentastar motor, which was in the JKs. And actually, it's the same horsepower and everything as the JKs. So uh, I think they made this hood aluminum too, which is a pretty light hood more uh, weight reduction that they did but you know pentastar has been on ward's top 10 engine list four different times now great motor uh fuel efficient uh just a really reliable motor for chrysler dodge jeep and ram and uh thank you for checking out the video hope you learned a little bit and uh we look forward to helping you with your next wrangler if you want to see more pictures of this one or one of our other 400 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle on our lot. Videos of every single used vehicle that we have all at summitauto.com. Thank you so much for checking out the video. If you want to make this one yours, give us a call right now, 920-921-0850. Ask for one of our sales associates to make this Jeep yours today. Once again, that number is 920-921-0850. Thanks again for checking out the video. If you like it, want to see more, go to youtube.com slash summit auto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. A link to more Wrangler videos like this one on your right. And if you haven't been to our website on the bottom, a link to this vehicle on our website. Click those, check us out, and we really look forward to helping you with the super clean 2018 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara JL.
Thanks again.